Conceive, believe, achieve. This is former UFC middleweight champion of the world, Michael Bisping. Paddy the Baddy here. You're listening to Combat Sports UK. And you're watching Combat Sports UK. <laughs> I'm glad you said it. Yeah, Lewis, obviously a phenomenal knockout, fantastic knockout. Um, the big talk point, obviously, is the strike versus grappling coming into this. But did you feel like that striking, you know, difference general was going to be so big? And obviously, it, 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 it showed show me. Yeah, listen, mate, I told, I told everyone I was going to knock him out in the first round, and I knew it. And I saw you in your other interview, mate, saying, I've only fought nobodies and shit. He's I didn't say no, that. You did, mate. You, I, did. you said I, I said I, I talked about listen, me, shit. <laughs> listen, mate. Listen, mate. Don't talk shit about me. No, I didn't. So I had to knock him out because you said you can apologise. <laughs> you can <laughs> apologise to him. I was talking about the competition. <laughs> uh, obviously, yeah, no, it was a big opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't talking about. <laughs> yeah, but obviously now you've got this win. Now we can yeah. talk about the competition you, you beat. Now. Yeah, yeah. That was a good step to go, obviously, further. Yeah, listen, give me anyone, mate. I'll fight anyone, anytime, any place, and I'll knock them out. Yeah. So, everyone come for me. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> and obviously, uh, we talked about, obviously, now what, what's next? I know we've got that big win. Uh, what will we looking forward to uh, now, next, in the future? Uh, well, we can, I can talk with PFL and see what they want to do moving forward. Yeah. But, yeah, I'm, I'm up for whatever, mate. As long as I'm getting paid to knock people out, <laughs> I'm happy. Thank you so much. Lewis. We saw that knockout. We saw that whilst we were interviewed. Um, is that how quick you plan to, to get the fight? Yeah, mate, I've, I've been saying all week I'm going <laughs> to knock him out in the first round and he was like, oh, yeah, yeah, say what you want, but I knew. I've, I've seen it, I've, I've dreamt of it, mate. I saw I knew I'm going to knock him out in the Coming first through. round. Yeah. Nice so much. Lewis, did you expect to get it done that quickly? Yeah, mate, like I've said, I'm, re I'm always ready to, to get him out of them. And I've, I've never felt as good in a fight camp, to be honest, you know. I've really settled in at Manchester top team now um, and I'm, I'm ready to go all the way to the top. I'm really, really ready. Having people like Kane, McGrillan, Dakota, staff, everyone like that in your corner and pushing you in the gym every single day, how much do you think that contributes to your development as a fighter? Massively, mate, massively. You know, we've got, we've got a good team. We're all young. It's a very young team, you know. The gym's only be open, been open for years and we've got fighters in every major organisation nearly in the world, you know what I mean? So we're in there every day. We work together. There's no working against each other. We're a proper team and we all want to do what the best for each other. So, yeah, that's a massive part of it, yeah. Fantastic bit, thank you. Obviously, Lewis McGrillan both springing the violence. Were you setting sort of the plans in motion for the rest of the night? You know, you got a bit of bragging rights there early on. You yeah. said, live up to that now. Yeah, hasn't definitely, it? mate. You know what? It's probably it. I've spent a full week, Lewis. Like, obviously, we're always together in the gym and that. One. We spent a full week in a hotel together, and uh, some of his uh, evilness has rubbed off a bit. <laughs> I think I showed that there tonight. So big, big up, Lewis. <laughs> yeah, you were, you were hyped after that. It yeah. was something that was a long time coming for you. Yeah. Wanted a violent finish. Yeah. Just. Did you see that coming from the get-go? Because he shot for a takedown. Yeah, quite yeah. Early. You know, it was very heavy in the front of his stance. You know, I, I knew he was going to rush the takedown, so I just sort of kept my distance. He walked onto a left hook, and then I let him build back up and put his wig off. Do you know what I mean? Lightning wig removal <laughs> services. Let's go. Think things have accelerated very quickly since you know the lead show that you main evented in the Vida promotion, yeah. which was incredible. You've got that fanfare. You've got an amazing sort of. Um, raucous crowds that from Leeds and we've mentioned how great of a fight city that is. Um, what's it been like with the added attention on you this week? We've seen you all over Instagram with, with PFL. It's been incredible to see. Yeah, yeah, you know what? Um, I didn't think I got that much media media attention compared to Lewis, but obviously Lewis is a superstar, mate. You know, he's blown up on every social media platform, so that's why I knew I had to put a show on tonight. I knew I had to put that show on, so everyone wants to talk to me now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> obviously PFL, um, the main PFL doesn't have an active bantamweight division, does it? No, is that no. your way of saying, get the bantamweight yeah, let's in? go, let's go. Give me some elbows, man. It's <laughs> not like there's no elbows, man. I want to elbow people, I want violence, man. I want violence. Obviously, coming so. from the amateur side of things, yes. you've had that before, yeah. haven't you? But what, was that an ongoing conversation you're having in your head saying, do not elbow? Yeah, yeah definitely, because I, I threw a few in the warm-up, mate. I was like, oh, I'm not allowed to do that, not allowed to do that. But yeah, you know, any rule set, I'll... I'm not sure if so let's go, let's go. <laughs> this is your space now to say, yeah. give me a contract. So. Yeah, man. Yes. How much do you want to pay me? Give me offer me. Make me an offer <laughs> PFL. Yeah. I'll let you enjoy the rest of your night. It's going to yeah, be man. an amazing It's an amazing time for Manchester top team, isn't it? Absolutely. 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 win last week, everything yeah. that he's gone through. Was that a major inspiration as well? Yeah, 100%, mate. You know, it's good to train with the guys that are already sort of in, in the top fighters in the world, do you know what I mean? Because I can test myself and see where I'm at. If you if you're not surrounded by the best, you don't really know how good you are. Like, so that that is a, a big part of it, yeah. You know, and when you have like them guys saying, you know, work a bit harder and you you can be here as well, then it it means something. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, 
Yeah, definitely. Post fight bonus as well? Yeah, hopefully. hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> Well done, mate. Cheers. Congrats on the win. In terms of knockout victories you've ever had, where does that one rank? No, mate. Probably, probably number one. Yeah. Probably number one. That you know, I've had um, most of my finishes are like dropped, and then like I'm, I'm a volume fighter more, more so. Do you know what I mean? I'm not like a, a one punch knockout artist. I'm, I'm, I'm volume, and I, I finish people <laughs> with like endurance and just putting it on them. But um, it's nice to put someone. Out proper on their ass like that, do you know what I mean? Proper sit them down, so yeah, probably probably number one, mate. And after, after making such light work of your opponent, I bet you can't wait to get back in. Then, yeah, man, I'm ready to go. Like, like I just said downstairs, get me a fight now, I'll fight again tonight. <laughs> Who wants it? Anyone? Me. Let's go. <laughs> You've been scaring the fighters, you're now scaring the media as well. <laughs> uh, a great high kick finish. Was that something you saw in training, or is that just in the moment? Uh, yeah, I mean. I didn't really come in with like a massive game plan for this fight um, because obviously Sam's been out um, like a couple of years, yeah, four years, yeah. So um, I didn't know what he was going to come with. Four years is a long time to change a game, so I just worked on myself, which my game's striking. Do you know what I mean? Punching, kicking, kneeing, sometimes elbows, not in PFL. Um, so I was just ready for anything, and the, if coming put pressure on me, but like you know, it wasn't intelligent pressure, and he just walked onto the shop. So yeah. Man, and, and just, just quickly on that, do you feel like the, with that time away um, played a part, obviously not being in, in, the, in, in the arena or in, in the cage for a long, obviously yeah, playing a part? Definitely mate, because, like, because I'm back fighting regular now, I'm so relaxed mate, like I had no nerves, it was just like a walk in the training, you know, having a long time off, you're going to build it up inside your own head and I knew he's not going to be good in the first minute, definitely he's not, because he's going to be he's gonna be tentative and thinking what happens, what I can't find him, where's my range, but I'm relaxed in there, I'm comfortable. And then just lastly for me, I know I caught you at Machine Ready the other week. Um, it was fantastic. Obviously, Ibrahim, Ibrahimov put on a fantastic performance. Now you've put on a fantastic performance. Match top team have got a really good scene in, and obviously you're, you're putting on that. Top team here, takeover, it's coming, it's coming. We're gonna take over the world, man. Trust me. So it's lightning by name, lightning by nature. Um, do you feel fresh? Do you have any injuries at all? Nah, no, mate, I mean, I think I caught my thumb a little bit on his head, but it's pretty sound. Yeah, I, mean, I don't think I took a shot, really. It might have scraped me with a few, but yeah, all good, mate. Ready to go, yeah. Nice, and what are we celebrating after? Is it a call in Leeds, or is it the game? Uh, I think I'm, I'm gonna go see all my mates downstairs now and see what I wanna do, but I think it's gonna be, you know, a bit of a chill one. Yeah. We'll uh, probably go for a, a few few beers with the boys. Thank them for coming. But yeah, pretty steady, mate. Yeah. And how was that rivalry then with, uh, with Lewis as well? Is it a healthy rivalry there? Is it? Yeah, of course, mate. We're, 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 we're like really good mates. You know, yeah. we we spar, we kick the shit out of each other in the gym, and then we'll have a laugh after. You know what I mean? We're, we're good mates, really good mates. So that's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. We're, we're doing it together, and we're, we're both gonna go to the top. Nice, you're immense tonight. Thank you, thank you. Last question, guys. You're a 5-0, best fight finishes. What's next for you? Anybody who wants it, bring me, bring me anyone, put me in front of me, and I'll, I'll finish you again. Yeah? Keep on doing your thing, yeah. Fantastic. Lewis, it's never just PFL, and you actually went for his best favourite. Talk us through how you felt walking into the cage. Yeah, well, some of my friends have bet on the fight, speaking about this, and they all, they've all bet on me and Lewis to win in the first round, so. That's why it's winning the first round, mate. Boy, some door. Everyone wins, you know what I mean? Yeah. Thanks, guys. Nice pictures. Yeah, 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 we'll get it, we'll get it, we'll get it. I'm just shaking the place.